Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, welcome to you as well. Today is the first episode in our moving series and we're cleaning out that closet. If you're new here, hi, my name is Francesca. I make vlogs, hauls, routines, and everything in between. If you like any of that, you should just go ahead and hit subscribe. Okay, I am almost never embarrassed to show my closet, but this just might be the time that I'm embarrassed. This is the state of my closet. Now, in my defense, right, some of this has happened because my dog has been taken to burrowing in my clothes and she's knocked over baskets and just like has caused slightly more of a mess. But yeah, this is what we're dealing with. So first thing I want to do is empty out these two baskets. These are clean clothes. These are clothes that have came out of laundry that I never folded. And I'm just going to empty them out on the floor of the closet. Um, my closet floor is pretty clean because I don't really come in here at all. <laughs> just kind of grab from the surface. Um, and I want to use these two black baskets to put dirty clothes in. Now that I have both of these completely empty, I am about to take all the clothes that are slightly worn or any dirty clothes that are here to pile up front and put them into these baskets. So over here, as you can see, there are a whole lot of hangers. I have this bad habit, even if I'm just trying on clothes, of just throwing hangers in places. Um, and yeah, so we're gonna pick those up. I want to talk about a couple items that are up here. This sweater dress is absolutely ugly to me. I don't like it. I got it to wear to the Black Panther Wakanda Forever premiere. Tried it on, didn't like it, never wore it. Was supposed to return it to Forever 21. I am probably gonna put this in my cell pile to go to Plato's Closet. And so I'm gonna start piling all that stuff up in this basket. These pants. Listen, 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 listen. This is another one of those situations where there is still a tag on this, and I've never worn this item. I purchased these pants for my birthday to go with this cropped velvet long sleeve shirt. Love the shirt. What was I thinking with these pants? Like, I get it was New Year's Eve for my birthday party, but why did I buy these? Um, I ended up getting sick, and I didn't get a chance to go to my birthday party. Never wore these pants. I'm glad I never wore them. They're terrible. I'm putting this in my sale pile. Otherwise, the rest of the stuff I'm keeping, I just haven't worn yet. This is a Wakanda Forever hoodie that my friend Trayvon got me. Um, it was supposed to be for the movie as well, but never got a chance to wear it because it came a little bit late. So I'm holding on to that. I put that on a hanger. This is that top. I like that. I have a bra that I don't even think I wear anymore. I might trash this because it's a little worn and I wouldn't want to give that to someone else. Tote bag, that can stay. Another tote bag, that can stay. Got some fishnets, which I don't even know. That's going to the donate pile. This is the top to my 90s. Gonna put that down there. This is a crop top that I purchased I don't even know why I purchased this top top, but it's a size extra small. And I don't know what, like, possessed me, 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 <laughs> to buy an extra small, um, but this is going in the sale pile. Then, otherwise up here, we have some hats, like, for the winter. I'm gonna pile, like, tote bags and hats up here in the corner, because I'm not really sure where I'm gonna put them quite yet and what I'm gonna do with them. Um... Um, and otherwise, I just have a hanger, so that's it for the top. Before I go through the process of going through all the stuff that is now on the ground, I want to kind of scan through what I have in the closet hanging up, and if it's not something I want, donating it, selling it to Plato's closet. So, 
the first couple of things I had already started picking out some things the other day that I do know that I want to get rid of I've been holding on to this Washington Nationals jersey for forever but listen it, it just I don't where am I wearing this you know like I think I wore it for 4th of July one year and then I wore it out to like a, a show or a concert I'm selling this or donating it it has no use for me anymore the next item that I'm selling or getting rid of that I'm really sad to get rid of is this Pretty Little Things brown dress. I love this dress. It fits so nice. It looks good on me. But I am a bigger chested girly. And the way this cowl top is, there, there's no there's no keeping everything inside. Like, it's not, it's not possible. It's uncomfortable for me to have to keep pulling up the dress. I'm selling or giving this away. Then we have this shirt, and I love this shirt. I love the color of this shirt. I love it dearly. It's another one of those things that it just comes down to the fact of, like, the way my chest is, this is not conducive. Um, with this being kind of a ribbed fabric, it does have the habit of scrunching up, and it reveals a lot. Um, so I am getting rid of it. I love this shirt so much. It's such a pretty color, which you can't really see because how the camera is, but it's like this cute kind of coral color, but... I'm saying goodbye. I am also saying goodbye to my beautiful nightmare on Elm Street nicely cut tank top. This is so early 2010s. <laughs> like, I would not wear this out in public. It's so cute. I love it. But it's going to have to go. This dress I wore to the beach a couple of years ago. It's definitely a vibe, but I just don't think it's for me anymore. I don't really like the style of it. It was a cute dress, but I know I'm not going to wear it. This is another one of those things that is going to hurt me to give away. I love this sweatshirt. I thrifted it. I love this sweatshirt so much. It's actually a men's medium. Um, but it has definitely shrunk a little bit, and I just don't foresee that this sweatshirt's gonna fulfill the same style that I'm looking for. Um, it's never going to be oversized on me again, no matter where life takes me, so I am gonna give it away, um, or sell it, but it hurts me. I love this sweatshirt. Slightly out of season, so there's definitely might be stuff that I have to give away instead of selling, but I have, like, four of these kind of terry cloth jackets. This one is supposed to be cropped, but because I'm so short, it just fits weird. Like, it's not long enough to be a regular jacket. I liked it, but it's hard to kind of pair it with clothes, so I'm going to give that away. This one is just, for me, it's too hot. Like, I, I like my Victoria's Secrets one, and there's, I think, another one that I have that's like a Walmart brand that I really like, but this is super thick. And I know when I understand, it's like, oh, when the winter is here, you'll appreciate it, but I don't. And I've definitely been in my puffer jacket era, and I don't foresee myself wearing this as, like, a winter, winter coat. So I'm going to let it go. That is pretty much everything that I'm willing to let go of that's already on a hanger. Um, now I'm going to grab stacks of the clothes that are down here and start folding them. I am not taking my dresser with me to our new home. <sighs> this dresser was a blessing to me a couple of years ago when I definitely did not have a dresser and I was thankfully able to um, get this for free from a friend's family and it served me well but it is very heavy. It doesn't match the aesthetic that I'm looking for. Um, I don't really use it. Like the concept of using a dresser for me is not really conducive to my thought process. So I definitely am looking for kind of an open um, organizational thing where I can kind of build racks in a closet and put my clothes on those. Until then, to move. I have these gigantic bins, which you can't really see. Oh, well, there you go. It's about the size of me. The depth is maybe like, you can fit my whole arm just about in there. Um, I'm going to be using these to store my clothes. So anything that I deem worthy to go on hangers will go on hangers. Everything else will need to fit in about two or three of these. I brought a total of three. I think I want to use the third one for something else. So I'm condensing everything that I own 
into these bins and on these hangers. So let's get started with that. completely cleared out my closet when it comes to clothes all of these lovely drawers are empty I have a few things up top here that I know that I'm gonna need over the next couple of days that are clean that I don't want to pack away um, in the back corner here this whole bag is filled with empty pop boxes I have over 120 pops and I keep the boxes just in case I ever have to resell them I need to come up with a better way to store them um, but I'm going to be repackaging my pops next. But outside of that, everything is all good to go. This bag here and that basket are all clothes that I'm either selling or giving away. All of these are dirty clothes. It looks a lot fuller than what it is, but got to wash all of those. And so I'm thinking I'm going to keep the essentials, the things that I wear all the time, in the baskets once they're clean. Just make sure that I fold them up. Anything that is not essential, I'm going to put in the other bin. I have officially cleared out my closet. I also like took away some of the shoes that I don't really wear. This is like a more seasonal bin of shoes. Um, so I'm getting rid of some of those. Next step is just to really focus on these boxes. Again, more pop boxes up there. I have my camera box, um, my degree, <laughs> um, some decorations, just things like that. I'm gonna go through all of that and package all of that up too. Well guys, that about does it for this part of the moving diaries. My closet is cleared out when it comes to all of my clothes. Um, the next video in the series that you guys will see will be me packing up everything else in the house. Um, so make sure that you subscribe if you love moving vlogs, if you love like room transformations, things like that. There's a lot of things coming up that you will definitely enjoy. I want to thank you guys so, so much for watching and I hope you have a good rest of your day.